Good morning, you guys. So I have a surprise for you. I'm parked at Planet Fitness waiting for Cora to come over here to get her shower. And look what I happen to see. Look at that. It's kind of hard to see. I'll turn the camera around in just a bit. But I just want to let you know, I think sometimes skills or creativity versus money. So if you're um, more creative, I was going to say createful, <laughs> personal joke anyway. So if you have more skill and creativity than you do money, you can make things happen just as well as having a lot of money. Look at that. That's a little Ranger, I think, a little Ford Ranger. But I'm sure it didn't cost him that much. And now he lives very cheaply or she lives very cheaply. I don't know which is which. Um, I'm assuming here, right? But I've seen a few of these type of uh, truck campers built. And I've even seen them build them in small trailers or flatbeds. But I think that's very, very talented for people to be able to do things like that, especially on the cheap. Hey, there you go. It doesn't cost you very much. Plus, you know, you don't have to buy a bigger vehicle or um, one of them camper shells would probably be okay, but I'm sure they want to be able to stand up. So they can probably stand up there. Um, like as far as me trading my car for a minivan, I had to, you know, make up the difference in money. And I don't think it cost that person or the couple, whoever lives there, uh, as much money to build that versus swapping vehicles. Especially if you already have a pickup, you can customize it, make it as uh, big as your trailer or your uh, back of the bed is, you know. I think a lot of them are four to six feet in the back, but when you do a little extension at the top, that can be great storage. Yeah, I just wanted to share that, guys. I think it takes more creativity and skill than money to be able to live a great life. So, I mean, you can do it the other way too and just have it ready made, but there's a lot of people that are willing to help you out there and you can do like um, building parties or um, there are already a bunch of those. You go to the build outs and they'll help you out. Even if you have a car, an SUV, a van, whatever, if you need to build a bed, if you need to build a frame for a little kitchenette or whatever, they'll help you out, install solar. So help is out there. It doesn't have to cost you very much. If anything, a lot of people will donate things to you. So just remember that. I think it takes more skill and creativity than money in a lot of cases even with buying a regular home you have to just keep an eye out and look for a fixer upper it might not be in the ideal city state that you uh, would prefer but hey think about it it might be worth the move all right guys talk to you later have a great one bye okay let me show you so this is a Ranger XLT, so I'm sure that's about six foot bed. But this guy or gal, whoever it is, just just constructed that. Simple, basic construction. There's no telling what you find out here nowadays. Everybody's getting more creative and savvy with their money. So if they can do it, and I can do it, you can do it if you choose to, if you enjoy it, of course. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a like, comment, and subscribe. Talk to you later. See you on the next one.